Blue Mountains have forced train cancellations. We'll have the latest forecast with our meteorologist David Brown a little later in the bulletin. So fierce were the recent bushfires that ecologists have serious concerns about how long it will take our trees to regenerate. But drones could soon be utilised to scatter seeds from the air, giving nature a helping hand. Signs of life are emerging across the swathes of blackened bush from this summer's fires. But experts say the sheer intensity of the blazes this time around means it will take longer for the environment to recover. There are seeds that are able to re-sprout after bushfires, but if fires are too frequent or are too hot, we are losing this capability. So we need to give nature a hand to put you know, the trees back and the plants back into the landscape. Now, an Australian-designed invention is in discussions with government to speed up that recovery process. AirSeed fits specialised drones with equipment that fires seed pods into the earth from above. We're basically taking Mother's Nature's, Mother Nature's way of regeneration and we just give it a big kickstart. Previously, reforesting using seedlings was painstakingly slow, but just one drone can plant 40,000 trees every day. We don't have the luxury of waiting a year to grow seedlings in the nursery and then take them outside a year, a year later to put in the ground. We have the ability to, to do it as a sort of rapid response, get them in the ground and help that rehabilitation start now. The company, currently operating in Central Africa, is planning on beginning local trials in April to be funded, it hopes, by an online crowdfunding effort. This is what we're doing, get behind us, you know, uh, together we can make a difference. Cameron Price, 7 News. Long before the coronavirus evacuees, Christmas Island was home to a...